Hey you guys! Hey you guys! So, welcome back to my channel. So, I just want to share with y'all this right here. It is Diva's Wigs. Okay? So, this is a Diva's Wigs. And I actually got this for my birthday. So, if you've seen any of my birthday photos, this is the hair that I was wearing in my birthday photos. And I think most of you guys did love it. It came in a beautiful box that I lost. I lost the box. I don't know where it is. It was my birthday and we we're getting all ready. But here's the card that came in the box. So um, the hair I got, I'm gonna leave the details in the description box of this very specific hair. But it's uh, wavy, silky, 22 inches. The density is medium heavy, color 1B. Um, obviously I have not, you know, blended this into it yet. I just put it on for you guys. So I'm just going to show you what the cap construction looks like and how I, you know, do my, my wig. <coughs> so this is my wig. This is her. Isn't she beautiful? When I first got it, I thought it was kind of thin, but it actually isn't thin at all. It's medium heavy density, but I still thought it looked small and it did look small. But once you start to separate the, um, the hair, it gets, it gets full, it gets full looking. So the edges had extra lace, which I just cut off and it comes with three combs. So two at the side, one in the center. And I went ahead and bleached the center, just the center portion of my wig, just in case I want to, um, you know, wear it with no leave out. I did that. So that's what that is, that I bleached that part. And there is no defined part in this wig. It's just a free, a free part wig. Okay, so what I did with my wig, I added two elastics at the back, at the bottom going from ear to ear, because I wanted to pull this part down closer to my head. Like I wanted to pull this part down on my head. So I added an elastic from here to the bottom. From ear to ear, yeah. So this is behind one ear, this is behind one ear. So that's where I added an elastic. And also Diva's wig comes with um, an adjustable, like looking bra strap at the back. Oh yeah, this is why I permed my edges. I permed my edges for this wig. This wig did it. It made me. So I kind of sewed down the top of my um, wig right here across there and I went ahead and added some, um, oh there you go, you can really see the picture coming right here. I added some of that, what's it called, um, edge control. So you actually don't need to have this out, like I completely take this whole thing and just put it behind my ear, I don't need it because it goes like that, right? And if you want to, you know, give it some volume fluff it up a little bit but this is a lot of hair guys a lot of hair I had to put a lot of water to calm it down it's so big so this is it guys divas wigs <laughs> so as for detangling it does get a little bit tangled because it's 22 inches of hair it's gonna coil around each other and get a little bit tangled up but all you need to do is use your fingers to finger comb it don't worry about trying to comb it with a comb just a little bit of this right is enough that's enough we do not need to comb it like a maniac okay all right also i just tried to you know braid my hair across the top to make it kind of crimply to match it if i had time i'd probably wrap it around rods or something like that to get a more wavy kind of look to blend it better but for me, for now, for the video, this, um, this is enough. The braid out, leave out thing, and then I just kind of took it, braids out, and separated the hair. 
Okay guys, so this is it. This is my hair review of Diva's wigs. I'll leave the code and all the links in the description box. And you can check their website out. They are having a sale discount. So check it out. Also, let me know what you think of this hair. Do you like this on me? Do you like this color on me? Should I dye it? Should I ombre it, guys? Because you know I've been feeling ombre lately. Let me know. Okay, guys. Thank you again for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye.